So in this video we're going to go over an example proof showing that a subset of R2 is a subspace. So what we're going to do is consider the subset of R2 and remember R2 is just the set, is just the set of all two component vectors. And we're going to pick a specific subset. We're going to say let's look at all vectors that have this form, all two component vectors that have the form R comma 3 times r and what we assume here is that r is just a real uh, a real number so we're picking vectors of a particular form so for example the vector 2 and 6 would have the form r 3r because 6 can be written as 3 times 2 so it has the form r 3r so all vectors of the form R3, R, we want to show that this subset of R2, because not every vector in R2 has this form, for example, the vector 1 and 5 does not have the form R3, R. R. But we want to show that all vectors that have this form form a subspace of R2. They form a vector space in their own right. So remember what we need to show from the previous video. We need to show that vectors of this form are closed under scalar multiplication and vectors of this form are closed under uh, vector addition. So first let's show it under scalar multiplication. So first we want to show show vectors of the form R3R are, are closed under scalar multiplication. So to do that we need to pick an arbitrary vector from uh, the, uh, the subset and we need a scalar. So let C be a scalar or just a real number which is all a scalar is and let the vector r sub 1 comma 3 r sub 1 uh, be an element of the given subset. So we want to look at this and identify, yes, this, this definitely has this form. So now note, if we do C times, we're going to do the scalar multiplication, C times R sub 1 comma 3 R sub 1, so we multiply an arbitrary scalar, an arbitrary real number, times an arbitrary vector that has the form we need. Well, we know how to do scalar multiplication, so this is going to give us c times r sub 1, comma, 3 times c times r sub 1, which equals, and so here's where we, here's where we nail it. We say, we notice that c times r sub 1 could be renamed. So if I name it r, c times r sub 1, if I name it r, some real number r, comma, this would be 3 times c r sub 1, it's just 3 r, where r has, uh, r is just the product, in this case, of c times r sub 1. So this shows that scalar multiplication is closed because when we do the scalar multiplication, we get something that has the form r 3 times r. So, and that's the key with closure. You're showing that after you do scalar multiplication, the thing that you get still has the form that's required for membership in the subset. So now I can conclude. So uh, the subset R3R R is closed under scalar multiplication. Now we need to show closure under uh, vector addition. So now we show closure under vector addition. So if we're going to add two vectors from the subset we need to create them. So let, let's say r sub 1 comma 3 r sub 1 
and we need two vectors so let's get some other vector r sub 2 3 times r sub 2 which are definitely elements of the subset so I could even go comma here which are clearly elements of or sub uh, sub their elements of the subset that has the form r 3 r now note that let's add them if we do r sub 1 comma 3 times r sub 1 and add it to a vector r sub 2 comma 3 times r sub 2 we know how to do vector addition we just do component wise addition so we do r sub 1 plus r sub 2 comma and then we would get 3 r sub 1 plus 3 r sub 2 equals r sub 1 plus r sub 2 comma and we can factor the 3 off of both of these so we'll get 3 times r sub 1 plus r sub 2 and now notice this has the it has the form this has the form r comma 3 r with r equal r sub 1 plus r sub 2 so the vector uh, the two vectors when we add them together the two vectors that came from this subset of r2 when we add them together we get a vector that has the form required for membership so the subset that looks like R3R is closed under vector addition because the set that looks like R3R is closed under scalar multiplication mol whoops multiplication and vector addition comma it is a subspace of R2 and we're done put a period give it a tombstone